Hello everybody, it's I there, Luigi Big Mac here. Welcome back to Pizza Tower. Last time we we completed 4-4, four, four, uh, beat up Baked Pepino. And we only have one level left to do, and that's war. And this one's gonna suck. There might be a chance if I have to do this in two tries? Might not. I'm probably gonna try and focus here because war is like a, a genuinely challenging. Uh... Uh, level for for various reasons. For various reasons. Another. I think I still have enough time to make it. Why oh, the fuck it shows up in this? Oh yeah. There we go, okay. Woo. That was a one. If I have to do this in two parts, then uh, then I might have to. Minute to uh, 
or actually three whole minutes to get out of here, because that's plenty of time. Especially, especially when the noise it goes up to be really, really fast. did it. Man, that was something. Alright, uh, we did get an achievement. I don't remember which one that was. I'm going to go check it real quick. Don't miss more than three shots in war. Yeah, I mean, like, I mean, considering you have a minigun, that's kind of hard to do. Anyway, 90, we have 90 bucks left to our name. So, let's lock the ball game for this, and we're going to exit out. Because you guys remember Mr. Mooney, right? Uh, who was totally not Mr. Stick, uh, dressed up as a hobo. That color scheme. And luckily, Sheriff Steve's still here, so that's nice. Now, here's the question. Nope, it's not here, so I'm gonna have to beat the final boss first before I show you how to lock swap mode. But, uh. Ooh, actually, you know what? We have plenty of time on our hands, so. I'm gonna go to change our outfit real quick. Actually, you know what? No, that's fine. I'll do it after we do the boss fight. Just so you can see what the costume is referencing. I'm probably not doing this just to extend the uh, video the video time. Hey okay, ready. Alrighty, so pizza face. Uh, same deal as last time, except, except, uh, he works slightly differently when you're playing as Noise. Because Noise has his bombs. Also, hold up. <laughs> Fuck you, pizza face. Because he has his bombs. Instead of having to throw enemies at him, you can just, you can just bait him into coming down. And then, uh, and then get him like that. And 
And because, and because of your bomb, and because your bombs move around on their own. It's, it's always a good idea to call the view around. Because, because your bombs can deal with the crowd control that uh, Pizza Fate will uh, throw at you. jump cut to uh to where we left off in phase two so i'll be right back all right round two baby let's try this again Out of the way, we can now get to phase three. <laughs> also, the voice is still dead, by the way. Nothing can match me with fire. But anyway, time to go take the same.
Oh, yeah. Uh, remember that Doid outfit? You unlock it by break dancing on the floor, by the way. Uh, just, just so y'all know. You have to wait for him to go through all of his attacks before you can hit him. Yeah, only you have the benefit of being able to stay far away. Because you can just kick a bomb. So you can so essentially, this has become infinitely easier because it can be the outrage. have to destroy the tower itself. Now you might be wondering well, what's different about this other than you know the different noise changes like you know you're gonna have the mini guns of the shotgun and you save noise dead and, and the noisy instead of Mr. Stick and uh Kusabo. Whoop, I need that. Uh, you'll see it just a minute. Also, the music's different. Obviously. And honestly, probably my- This is probably my favorite track from the, uh... Uh, from the noise- From the new track that added for the noise update. Uh, so here's the other difference. You don't save uh, Fake Pepino, uh, Vigilante, or Peppermint. Or Snotty for that matter. Also, the, also these guys, uh, 
are still are still friendly, by the way. So also this has also this section was made easier because you still because the noise because you're still always guaranteed to get free more for like in that uh, right like in ball. Got a P ring for that very last level. That's actually pretty neat. And I got all the toppings, so I think I've completed everything for criteria that's needed. <laughs> also, yes, the ending is different. Now. Even the credits are different. And, well, here's all these talented people who uh, create all these uh, noise stickers that uh, cover up the uh, level intros. And, as it turns out, the reason why this whole thing happened is because the noise wanted to make a movie about what happened at the tower. Now let's see how we did. How we did. cleaning up. Now because there's, because there's one thing I have yet to show you guys and that requires you to beat the game. Well first let's head in here. Uh, first thing first, they added a new uh, secret level. They added a new secret level to this game. Uh, you know, actually, let's do it, because I, I don't think I have Secrets of the World. Because I never did it for the original Pizza Tower level. Mainly, I never did it for the original Pizza Tower uh, uh, let's play, because this came out during the Halloween update. And you're essentially going through all the secrets of, of the level. Ten secret, secrets of the world. And, and each one, you have a... Each one... Oh. 
Okay, asshole. There we go. In each one, you have a... Each one, you have a 25-second uh, time limit. about how I feel about the noise update. So, overall, I feel like this update was definitely much needed. Because, A, it, get, it, gives you, it gives you another reason to play the game. Because the noise... Was like, and this is something that they already announced that they're going to do. Shit. Okay, I might lose here. Especially when shit like that happens. Yep. Oh well, not a big deal. Yeah, that that level is nothing too special. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go out on my way to complete it. But at least I showed it off. And then sound test. Uh, only plays the new songs uh, added to this update. Also, shout out to the, uh, shout out to the, uh, song for, uh, uh, Crumbling Tower Pizza. Shout out to the fact that, that its song is called, uh, I Need a Noise. Actually, hold on. Before, before you, before you even do anything. There we go. Super noise. And this is what you get for uh, not not missing, not wasting a single bomb. On uh, there's that P ring. Uh, but yeah, this is what you get for uh, not wasting a single bomb on uh, Pizza Face. And then finally, how do you unlock swap mode? This is how. See, here's Peppino. And it's play as plenty tutorial music. Like yeah, here's all of his war medals, even though he's not a war veteran. Uh he's there's a Peppino mech. Relatives, his pistol from the vigilante fight, uh, a poser of Snake 2 with tail, and then now you're supposed to get a screen. I'll probably put it up here on what it's supposed to look like, but right, but right there, that's what that's what the screen would have looked like when you unlock the swap mode. And, and I'll also show the screen that you get when you unlock the noise as. As uh, you lock the noise as soon as you beat the uh, uh, base game piece of tower as Pepino, because because uh, 
Essentially, the, I think the best way I can summarize this update is that they added a new game plus to the game. And I think, and I definitely think that was something that was much needed. Let, let's just have noise sit on the couch here. Uh, but, yeah, I think that's... I think that's everything I I have available to show off about the noise update. Actually, well, actually no, I lied. Because I still need to show off. What? So the character select screen is now back. And this is two-player, by the way. Local uh, two-player, but that's besides the point. You can play swap mode one player. So the way it works, swap mode. If both players hold dash, now luckily, now unfortunately I'm, I'm the only person here, so I cannot make the noise dash, but if both characters dash, they uh, they get into they get into a fight. And whoever let's goes last gets basically gets to be in control. Like basically, the, the whole intention of this of this mode is basically you're, you're basic you're basically trying to dick over each other because the second player can grab can grab the other one and throw them. However, however, there is specific frames they can only do it for. So essentially, you can do it. With, so it's so if player so if the person in control messes up. The, the second player can grab them. The second player can, can, can grab them and throw them out of the way and take control. And then taunt swap. So the way it works is that you press down uh, when you taunt, you get to swap between uh, between Noise and Pepino. So let's let's go and do Junk Gunner since that's since that's a relatively short level. Yeah, so you get so you get the noises for uh, like moves dead here. But let's just say I want to uh, switch the switch the Pepino. I didn't do that. It switches to his piece, piece of timing, which I think is pretty cool. Also, every time you get hit, it switches to the like. Let me get, like let me get myself hit by by the Fortnite here. Every time you get hit, it switches to the other character. So that's the other thing you want to keep in mind. Then let me let me start. Let me activate the uh, last two real quick. Just showed off with the music. Does it, it does the same exact thing in lap two? And plus, I have plenty of time, so I might as well do it. Since this was a relatively short episode. Yeah. So, 
pretty neat, pretty neat uh, attention to detail there. And then there's one last thing. I, there's one last thing uh, to add a bit of competition. Uh, well, much needed competition, mind you. To this, uh, to this boat here. Oh yeah, the other thing I should mention, because you're using the noise save file for swap mode, any, uh, you can actually use swap mode to cheat some of the outfit unlock criteria. So like, so like the, uh, don't waste up, so like, don't waste up bomb, you can just play Spepino the entire time and it'll still get you the outfit. And then the other thing is that when you complete a level, it'll tally up the score of both players. So Pepino won that time. So, so you see a very angry mode there. Oh, that's that's actually kind of you know what? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave them right there. So with that being said, I think this is finally the end of the let's play. And you and I probably won't touch uh this tower again. Unless they do another like major, major update, which I highly doubt. Uh, so if you guys enjoyed the let's play, please consider subscribing. I really appreciate it. Uh, comment, like the video, help uh, help the channel grow. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next let's play, where we're probably going to let's just say we're going to be objecting to a lot of things, and I mean a lot. Until then, see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Thank you.